Hey guys, got a short and sweet one for you today. Just a little trick I do to get these uh, C or these uh, cup springs in for these drum brakes. I know a lot of people struggle with this kind of stuff. Um, this is one of the main things people struggle with when you're getting the drum shoes on is the spring that goes through the back of the backing plate here with the stud. Um, I did manage to get the correct size studs for mine. I know that was a problem I mentioned in the earlier video. So just stick your stud in like you normally would and stick your uh, brake shoe on here. Get on the stud first. There we go. So once you're Brake shoes on. Get your seat, your uh, cups, cup springs, and you're gonna want a snap ring pliers that looks like this. And you stick the the first cup onto the stud, just like that, and then you take your second one, put the spring on. And you want to take your snap ring pliers and spread it just enough to fit right there in the cup. And then push the cup onto the stud here. It takes a couple times sometimes. Get it lined up. And there we go. I had to do it off camera because I had to have my cameraman hold the damn uh, shoe on for this to actually work because when I put the other side on, it was pushing the cylinder outwards towards the other shoe and it wasn't allowing me to, to uh, you know, keep it, hold it in place without the uh, stud wanting to come out the other way. But the other side, it took literally 30 seconds, probably less, to do this. This side... Um, it took a little longer, obviously, because it kept slipping, but it really didn't take all that much time considering, uh, you know, a lot of people when they do drum breaks, they struggle with these things for hours. I've seen people, you know, just trying their damnness to get the thing on. All you got to do is put your snap ring inside the cup like this, um, you know, just like that. And uh, once you get it compressed all the way, just use a snap ring, spread the snap ring to keep it within the walls of the cup and turn the cup just like that so the slot will line up with the, uh, with the stud. And then once it's in there, let go and uh, just kind of move it around a little bit with your hand to make sure that it's right in the middle of the two uh, indentations for it. Otherwise, you're going to run the risk of this exploding off and uh, launching across the room at warp speed. So uh, that is my little trick for these uh, cup springs and studs on drum brakes is to do it like that. So the more you know, I guess. Hopefully that helps somebody.